everyone, welcome back to The Breakdown, and today we're going to be teaching you how to download and install Minecraft skins in 2022. This is going to be a complete guide. We're going to show you where to download skins, how to install them, all of that stuff. But first, we have a miss from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to start your very own 24-hour DDoS-protected Minecraft server. We love just Apex so much that we host our own server. Play our breakdowncraft.com on them. So if you want to start your own server, look no further than Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get your server up and running. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and get a skin. Here we are on the skin decks. This is linked in the description down below. It's the second link down below under Apex. And once you're here, you'll be able to find the skin that you want to download. Now, there are tons and tons of different skins on this website. I mean, literally, there's probably over 100,000 skins. And uh, yeah, you can kind of search for whatever you want up here at the top as well. For example, if you want a knight skin, you can search for that. And uh, I really like this one right here. So we're going to come here. And what we're going to do is click on the download button on the right-hand side over here to download a skin. Now, that's how you can download a skin from this skin decks. Again, second link down below. But if you want to make your own Minecraft skin, we have an in-depth guide on that as well. And that is also in the description down below, how to make a Minecraft skin in 2022. It goes over everything that you need to know about getting your own Minecraft skin created in 2022 using the skin editor. So go through that tutorial if you want to create your own. Otherwise... Skindex is here for you to search for a skin and find the perfect one. Once you have your skin downloaded, we can minimize our browser, and I'm going to guess it's going to be in your downloads folder. Get that to your desktop just to make things easier to do that. You want to go ahead and click the little Windows icon, top left of my screen, bottom left of your screen, or in the center of your screen on Windows 11. And yes, this does work on Windows 11. Go ahead and type in downloads. We have this downloads file folder here. Click on that, and there is the skin we downloaded. Drag this to your desktop. Once it's in Minecraft, you can remove it from your desktop. Now we need to go ahead and open up the Minecraft launcher. And what's great is you can change your skin in the Minecraft launcher. So step one, it's done. Now it's time to how to install a Minecraft skin. Well, it's pretty simple. Open up the Minecraft launcher is step one. Then you want to click on skins right here, right at the top under Minecraft Java Edition. And then you want to go ahead and click on this plus new skin button here, right? Once you click on that, you can go ahead and enter in your Minecraft skin name. In this case, it's going to be Knight because this is a Knight. You can select your skin model, either the Slim or Classic, and then you want to click Browse and then select the skin file you downloaded. Here it is for us. As you can see, same one in the background, and boom, there it is. It's a cool skin. Now we can go ahead and click either Save or Save and Use. Both are the same. If you click Save, you'll need to hover over this and click Use. Otherwise, it works. And what's cool is you can see these skins are saved. So if we want to go back to my old skin, I can just click on Use right like so. Oh, I don't like this one. I want to go back to the one that we just installed. I can click it right like that. If it doesn't work the first time, by the way, you might have to click use a few times to get it to work. I've had it error out and do that before. Now you can go ahead and jump in Minecraft, click play. Let's do a quick jump cut. I'll meet you in game. And just like that, here we are in game with that skin installed on Minecraft Java Edition. Awesome stuff. That's how you can get a skin on Java Edition. But what if you're on Bedrock? Well, the downloading process is exactly the same. Downloading skin on Bedrock Edition is exactly the same as Java Edition. So once you've got your skin, let's go ahead and get it installed on Bedrock Edition. To do that, I'm going to need to close out of Java Edition. So I'm going to close out of Java Edition and we need to just open up Minecraft Bedrock, right? So I'm going to be doing this here on the PC because, well, that's just easier for me. But here we are opening Minecraft Bedrock. I'll meet you on the main menu. So here we are in Minecraft Bedrock Edition and you guessed it. To install your skin on the right hand side, just click on dressing room right here. When you click on that, it's going to open up this where you can then click edit character. Once you're in here, finally, we can go ahead and select a skin. To do this, we want to click on this like little basically icon with a bunch of different Minecraft characters. And then you want to click on owned. Then finally, you want to click on this import button right here. When you click on that, you can see an old skin that I have, but we're going to go ahead and click choose new skin. Then we can double click on that skin file we downloaded, select which model we want. This is going to be the, you know, classic model. That's going to be the slim model. Select one and then boom, we're done. There's that skin. We can then jump in game and that skin will be active. You can also see what your active skin is here on the uh, basically kind of bottom right of the Minecraft Bedrock main menu. And that's how you can go ahead and install a skin in Minecraft Bedrock and Minecraft Java Edition. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below. As you can see, this skin is in game. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown, and I am out. Peace.